Thank you so much for joining me this game edge. We are back in Medieval Dynasty where we left off last episode. Well, we got some pretty nice, uh, well, we got ourselves a person joining our village, which was really nice. I'm not sure why these things keep on growing back. Stop it. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Pick them up. Pick them up. All right. Yeah, we just have to kind of get rid of them. For some reason, they keep on coming back. But whatever. It's okay. It's early access. Hopefully, uh, there'll be a way for us to take away stumps and stuff. All right, for now, we're going to need to get some sticks. We do have some inside of our locker stuff. I'm thinking about building a fence today. I'm also waiting to see whether I need to move that trap for that bird trap to straight. I think we might have no choice. Uh, we're going to check out how our fair maid is doing on the other side. She is around here. Let's get rid of some of these. I want to trip over it when she's going back into the room with us. Over there. Okay. And then I'm, right now, today, we did talk to her previously. I don't think we can talk to her again. We'll go and check to see if she's okay. Yep, let's walk into uh, wood building with the torch. That sounds like a good plan. How you doing? You doing okay? Keep busy? Yeah, the store's good. Good stuff. All right, yeah. She's, she's in good mood. <laughs> she's in a good mood. Okay, let's grab her stuff right here. And uh, sticks. We're going to have to get ourselves somebody else, uh, of course, to help us out for building and other things. And also, well, not building, but taking care of the fields and hunting. We'll probably have to move our hunting lodge a little bit deeper in. Probably near the, over there, a little bit further out. Uh, for us to be able to hunt near the actual animals themselves. We see the foxes and stuff. We do know in a certain area that we could do that. So that's awesome. Um, I do want to make myself a nice new, of course, hammer. Unfortunately, I don't have the uh, coin or the iron, I think, to finish that up. So we're not going to do that today. I'm going to put this down right here. I want to leave this part a little bit open. Okay, how about right there? And then we'll move this here. We're going to follow a little bit of the road. That's causing such a problem this thing. Oh, there we go. So just a little bit to that side is good. Fine, fine, fine. I'll take it. I do want to leave some kind of seam open here for them to walk around and uh, to be able to walk in and out. I don't want to kind of hinder them from walking from that part. And build to walk up this. this is what I'm talking about. And leave an opening here a tiny bit, and then we'll do the same thing here. That's really close to that. Darn it. Okay, go back. And we're gonna continue building that. Boom. We'll do it a little bit more on the road, I think. No, I think that's as far as I can go. Alright, well, that's okay. We'll put it right before this tree. There we go. And then we'll have to probably chop down this tree after all. Oh, that's too bad. All right, well, we'll grab this stuff. Looks like this tree is in the way. We don't need a stinky tree. All right, <laughs> get rid of them. Now, the berries are there. We have to wait for summer, right? And I think currently, if I'm mistaken, we are still in spring. These should be still unripe, the berries over there. Okay, let's chop down. Actually, it would look nice with that tree right there. You know, to tell you the truth, I, I kind of like that. I'm looking at it going, you know what? It, it kind of it looks nice in between. I'll try and avoid chopping it down. Right like that. Just have a little bit of a gated area. Can we put one from here? Or are we uh, limited here? I think we're limited in what we can do for that. That is fine. We could at least try and test this out. Get a little bit of a fence up today. Would be nice. It's going to cost a couple sticks. How much is that? Five sticks per. Not so bad. God, I wish I had the other hammer. If the axe does what it does already, what we've seen, definitely going to be better to get that nice new hammer. It's something I want to invest in for sure. All right, move up our skills too at the same time. Nothing like building a tiny bit. And uh, I check to see if the trap. Yeah, this trap, I might have to move it. I think I might have to move it to a different location. I don't know. I didn't see wild birds uh, running around or on the ground or anything, so I don't know. No pheasants or anything. I have no idea if that's just a bad location for it. Oh, yeah. Pant if you want, buddy. You're fine. We're going to get some water in a second. And I'm going to avoid using my canteen as much as I can. The reason for that is because it, it does get used after a certain amount of time. I want to make another one, and I don't feel like making another one right now. Or actually buying another one, I should say. Not make. Okay, why does that stick like that? It's kind of interesting. Oh, it's just the way it looks. Okay. It's not supposed to be a uh, rugged. We can actually upgrade these, if I'm not mistaken, as we go. So we're going to have to wait for that. Door, but I think we can do an upgrade on this. I'm going to check that out, actually. Right click. And I oh know there's repair. And upgrade. Can I upgrade these? 
you know, we have to build them as is. Gotcha. All right. You just have to right click on that, by the way. People ask me all the time how you do that. You just right click. And there we go. So I'm going to have to do some work now and probably gather some materials and stuff and keep ourselves going so we can sell off to the village. But I'm probably going to go head out here and see if we can get anybody else to join us. Oh, it looks pretty darn nice with the fencing, doesn't it? It does look really nice. All right. And uh, drop off some sticks and stuff I don't really need to carry. Oh, she's coming out. I'm coming out. You're not going to bed, are you? How you doing? Hello, beautiful lady. Uh, do you have a bit for me? No, you don't. All right. Well, we have done given her a job to do. Yeah, we should probably need, rename you something I can actually pronounce. Uh, <laughs> Laura, Laura, Lair? I have no idea how to say that. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to even bother with it. <laughs> just, just let it be. All right, put the uh, wood hammer back in there. We want to keep as less as possible. I brought some of the plants and stuff we could probably sell off. Or maybe hit up a tree or two and uh, see if we can sell anything off of there. I probably will bring the fencing down to here and leave the opening there. But for now, uh, nothing in the traps, right? No. I can see the rabbit trap's still full, too. It's okay. It's all good. Yeah, we can up a couple of these trees. Now, what I've heard, they grow back. I can't really track which one's growing back if they have. If What the hell is that? Anybody know what that sound is? The heck was that? Is something on me? Is someone using Jiffy Pop? What the hell was that? Yeah, I went to watch other axes degrading somewhat fast, I find considering it is a, a good axe. We should be able to sharpen them. I don't know if we can repair them or not. I don't think we can. That's the thing that kind of sucks about that. But yeah, we're going to chop down trees next to their base because we're going to sell off the stuff to them. There's also a fine lady who's tending the chickens over there. We helped her out, and for some reason, she's still not, not too keen about us. What the frig? Don't choke the chicken. Okay. Whoa. There we go. Nice. Hit up the lugs. Grab what we possibly can. Some danny lines right there. I'll probably avoid hitting up the trees in their place. I kind of feel bad that I'm taking that. I forgot to grab water. I did make some food before I left. Uh, just over here. So in case we get a little hungry. But I'm not, we're not going that far. So I don't know. Just out of habit. Okay. We should be able to craft up a whole lot faster from our upgrade last time. So yeah. Let's see how this goes. There's 12 of them. All right, so maybe best not to come in with the town with the axe right now. We're going to talk to this fine lady, and then we're going to sell off her wares. I think it's the chickens that are doing that. To do that. I don't know. All right. Uh, actually, she actually the approval rate is pretty good. Do you have a minute? A minute. Uh, yes, 10. Okay, maybe we can ask her to come and join us now. Uh, do you have uh, Do you have another minute to do this? Just a thought. Oh, God, I don't know which one. Uh... God darn it. I, I messed that up. That's for sure. All right. Uh, I want to tell you, you have beautiful eyes. Okay. She kind of liked that. That's good. <laughs> we have like people all over. These people are going to be just like liking us a bit more than they should, but that's okay. All right. I don't know if I can move her over to us unless we date her, I guess. I don't think we can offer her to come and join us. Um, all right. Do you have anything else here? No, that's all we have for today. Okay. Well, you know, I gave you money to help out. And, uh, you know, at least you'll, you'll like me. Yeah, Nimir, how old are you? You're 19 years old. And uh, do you have men? I don't know what's up with you, dude. There we go. Uh, how's the job? Plus 12. That is fantastic, dude. You know, you at 12, 82, and he won't join me. How about you? Do you like me? 68%. All right, do you have a minute? How you been lately? Good. All right. Everybody likes me that uh, can't come over for some reason. That's great. I, I, I need somebody else to join our, our area here. How you doing? What are you doing with your hands in the ear like you don't care? All right. Uh, nice weather. Yes. Good. She uh, she likes me a little better now. <laughs> That's good. How's the job? Heard any gossip? I hope to God she likes that. Good. She is a gossiping queen. Is she like... Oh, no. Don't move. Come here. We have to continue talking. Uh, okay. We're not... We're, she's not into that beautiful lady kind of stuff here. That's fine. Recently, uh, I got into hunting. Any tips? She's into that, too. She's a hunting woman. How old is she? Maybe because she's much older than me. Yeah, 54 years old. That's why. Well, well. I still approval ratings is good. One of these dudes here did want to go. No, not you. I'm not wasting my time with you. Uh, yeah, you, you didn't like me either. Yeah, you know what? There's nothing I could do about that. Is this guy too young? Is this one 19 years old? 
Again, I don't know if I can get anybody else to join my town here. I'm creating a new settlement. All right, yes. All right, good. Let's talk. How have you been lately? Everybody seems to like us talking about them. That's good. Uh, well, we're going to do it again because it was a plus 10 on that one. All right. This guy wants to come around and do us. Good stuff. All right. You like to join my town? Meet you there, buddy. Come on. Don't mess around with my wife, all right? I want to soon be wife. Don't you dare, dude. I'm fornicate anyway. I'll tell you. I have some serious problem. All right. 50% in this one. All right. Do you have a minute? How you been lately? That's good. Everybody seems to like that. Okay. Um... Uh, go back to work in fields recently. Any hunting? I don't think she's going to... Oh, she doesn't like that. Great. Um, okay. Well, she doesn't want anything else to do with me. Maybe in the future we'll be able to have her come by and do some stuff. I think he's going to bed, isn't he? Nah, yeah. So now I have a whole bunch of stuff I can't sell because everybody's gone to bed. That is fantastic, right? Yeah, they're, they're sleeping. Everybody's sleeping and selling stuff. Now we'll have to do that in the morning. Uh, what I'll end up doing is most likely drop the stuff off here and hopefully they will uh, let me pick it back up next time because I'll just drop it right here on the ground. It seems to work really nicely, by the way. So if you want to, you can uh, just drop off some stuff and I have been able to at least carry it back with me afterwards. The guys don't seem to steal, which is nice. All right, we have a couple of spears right here. Let's do that. And yeah, no, no, I don't want to press F. There we go, X, and we'll drop all of you fine spears down. I hope to God they don't fall or roll anywhere further than they have to. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. And water skin torches, anything else here? I think, yeah, we need to drop off some of you. Oh, well, we'll eat some too, if we can. And we'll drop off about that much of it. We have tons already. Uh, with, oh, well, just take another one too. We'll drop off a couple more. All right, that's great. So I'll be able to at least sell off some good stuff tomorrow morning with this fine dude. Uh, let me work the night off here. I'm going to try to uh, cut down as many trees and put some spears there so we can sell off to a fine dude. And uh, yeah, and hopefully the guy over there is good. Now, do I need to manage it from where he's at? Oh, I could do it from here. Okay, what, what are we going to give him as a job here? That's the important part. We need to figure this out. All right, so I sent him off as a hunter for now. All right, so it looks like everybody is finally getting up for the day. Thank goodness, because I got a lot to sell. How you doing? I think you're young, aren't you? Yeah, you're 15. How you doing? Have a good day. Have a good day. All right, let's show me your wares. We got some stuff to sell. I've been working my butt off, off camera, trying to get as much as sold as possible. And yes, we need to make our money. Money, money, money. They got some cash on them, so why not take as much as possible out of that? To be fantastic. We got some wooden bolts, uh, stuff too. I, I did, uh, I wanted to sell them. Actually, I wanted to leave them behind. So, yeah, I didn't want to sell them. That's what I meant to say. So, we have uh, tons of these. And uh, thankfully enough, I did eat a bad mushroom, which I found in a field. It's an older one I left behind, and I didn't mean to eat it. So, yeah, it ended up being a bad day. And thank God for St. John Wards, because it took about a couple of them, and I, I got that done. Yeah, we got tons of stuff to sell. It's still here, thankfully enough. Okay, some firewood, some that. Uh, I'm overweight. Oh, God darn it. Come here. Come closer. <laughs> Come closer, dude. I've got a couple of things I want to uh, sell for you. All right, the firewood's probably very, very heavy anyways. Let's drop that on the ground. Do I have enough to walk? No, I know I don't. All right, uh, sticks. Let's drop that on the ground. And I guess the spears, right? How many spears? 21. Okay, maybe, maybe that's the reason why I game edge. <laughs> Let's drop uh, half a stack here. 15 kilograms. Should be able to walk with that. Fantastic. And then turn around. All right. <laughs> he turns around at the same time. He's wonderful. He's got $1,000 again to spend here too. Let's make that happen. Let's sell off everything we can. And again, we're making some good coin off of this stuff. So why not, right? And uh, what else we have here? We have rocks and stuff. No, hold on a second, everybody. Just give me a second here. Let me grab everything I can here. Reach. Can I still carry all this? Oh, I can. I'm a little heavy, but I could do it. All right, show me your wares again, buddy. <laughs> Oh my God, there's so many of them. Okay, I'm going to keep a couple for home in case. I, I think I have some already. Don't get wrong. I just, uh, you know, I always like to keep a couple for us in case we go somewhere else. These are really nice too. Uh, they sell off pretty good and we're doing okay. He's down to like $171. Okay, um, I'll have to go back and talk to your fine lady here. 
Looks like I took all his money, pretty much. And show me your wares. Thank you very much. You got sold 600 bucks. We have $2,000. That's wicked. Sold. Anything else? Uh, I think I got everything else sold to you. I want a little piece of firewood with that. How about some sticks? All right. Hopefully, I'll get some money soon for you guys. <laughs> you can sell this stuff off. Oh, have a good day. All right. Let's go and see if there's anybody else around here. Am I stinky? I am somewhat stinky. Not a whole lot. Let's see if we got anybody else to join us today there, too. Anybody else? Uh, no, he doesn't really care to move around. I should probably be holding a spear like that. That's probably not the best idea. Okay, Shh. did she want to speak? Yes, yeah, she did. How you been? Okay, she really doesn't like me. What is that? Is the chicken lady uh, okay with us? Or is it because I stink? I think it's because I stink. I can wash myself right here. I'm working hard. Maybe it's just I'm holding a stick right in her. There we go. That's probably a rude thing to do. Okay, um, yeah, I want you to join my stuff, but you still can't join me, right? So I'm going to have to try and get you to become a wife sooner or later. Uh, lots of makes it easier, okay? Lots of money like I do makes it easier. That's a little bit of a, uh asshole thing to say. Okay. <laughs> Look at me how rich I am. I hate that. Admire uh, you, honestly. Uh, okay, I'm afraid. Tell you other behaviors. That's good. Having lots of money. Now, okay, we're going to go with that one. Okay, well, that's enough for today. Uh, we do have two people anyways. We made some serious good coin. I'm not going to lie to you. We did take one person out of this village, too. This guy's doing what? Is he hovering? Dude, you're hovering. Can you, can you just move a little bit? Okay, he tilted himself. Holy David Blaine. All right, well, let's get ourselves back and see what we can do with our five people. We'll wash ourselves off and then maybe chat to them and get ourselves prepared. Also, check out our fine fencing and see our traps if they've been set off. If not, I'm going to have to move that bird one. I'm going to have to move it no matter what. Yeah, it looks like we got something for that bird one. Oh, thankfully, good. Good, good, good. We'll grab that, activate it. And what do we have here? Collect bird. So what do we get for that? Feathers? Is that all we got? I think we only got feathers. We got meat there, and we got some feathers, I bet you. Yeah, quite a few feathers. All right, so it does work. It doesn't make a difference. You have to be close or anything. Looks like the birds might go down in there and get some seeds we might have dropped in there. Uh, that's too bad for them. Okay. Wash yourself off, dude. Been working your butt off. Made some good money. Money. There we go. Yeah, clean behind the ears. Very nice. And then we're going to take a little sip. I want to cook up some food. Fresh food for us, of course. We have to get rid of that plot there, too. We're not going to use that. And I don't know where a fine lady is. I think she went off to work. Yeah, all right. Um, you know what? I could probably drop off a couple of you. We do have, of course, that. That's nice. And we'll drop off a few of you. There we go. And a few of you. I always like to leave, like, a couple more inside these things. They always handy to have. And we can sell some off afterwards if we really need to. We get desperate. All right. Cook up all these. We are, I think, getting a little better cooking. It seems to go a little faster than it used to. And, uh, yeah, pretty good. That's a, that's a lot faster, actually. All right. Good. It feels like it is, at least. If I'm wrong, well, so be it. All right, eat, 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 beauty. And then we're going to talk to the beauty over here. Hopefully she won't hate us. Hello. I have work for you to do. Do you have a minute? Uh, yeah, I think she liked the gossip, Maria. She liked the gossip. We want to keep her good and happy. And I think we don't have to really worry about that as much as I want to do this. You look beautiful today. It's absolutely. Do you use a washing tub? It would be very nice if you could. Uh, you know, I like you a lot. Okay, that, uh, that didn't work out. God, I just got shot down by the friggin' uh, uh, All right, well, it looks like rain is coming down. All right, so we're fine guy over here. I'm not gonna... I just want to see how he's doing. Are you gonna do anything at all? Yeah, you should have work out here and doing some stuff. I'm not sure how that's gonna work out. We're gonna have to kind of work on that a tiny bit. Uh... How's the job? I hope it's doing all right. Bastard. Okay. Doesn't like us now. <laughs> really? Come on. I was actually going to compliment you, buddy. Wow. Somebody is in a bad mood today. We'll just let him be then. All right. We'll drop off our fine wares over here. I want to see if we can make those arrows that we have. And we'll grab a few rocks. How much weight is that? Six. Okay. And then you need some more sticks, right? I have actually quite a bit of sticks, and I have feathers. 
Do I, uh, how many feathers do I have in here? How many, many? Let's grab them all. And uh, we'll take off this. And we'll go and see if we can craft up some stuff here. Where is it again? There and right here. So these are wooden bolts again. God, I want arrows. Stack of arrows. So what do we need? Feathers. We need 50 feathers to make this happen. We're going to get a shitload more traps, aren't we? Why can't I just make regular arrows? Like one on a shot here. Survival, nothing at all for us to do. All right. Oh, we need to make stack of arrows. We can't just grab what we want to do. Well, that's just freaking great. Okay. Well, throw the rocks back in there. And hopefully this guy can do something and actually uh, help us out a tiny bit. Hopefully he'll do some work. It would be nice. Okay, I think we're going to have to go hunting a tiny bit today and head out uh, with our spears and stuff. We'll probably grab ourselves a couple of logs here. And we have... Actually, we can do it in, in the forest. Let's do it in the forest. And let's go and hunt a tiny bit and bring back some food to show this guy how it is. Now, I might have to move the hunting lodge, like I said, just a little bit further out uh, towards that area. I'm not positive if we have to or not, but there is some animals that like to roam around this area over here. So we're going to chop down a tree and make ourselves a couple of spears. Just because we seem to have problems, they do break really quick. They're not good quality spears, but they are something, right? At the same time, we are helping ourselves out. Ooh, there we go. Nice. Okay, craft that up. That should be more than enough for us to do. We'll probably have a couple of them break on the roll, but at least we'll be able to get that done. We're also going to have to look at maybe in making another axe very shortly. Again, I would love to be able to just fix her up. You want to say sharpen it, maybe, when we get to that level? Maybe the devs, I mean, that's something we can do. I don't even know, but it's possible. I just don't know if we can. There's a dough right here. Okay, lift your head up one more time. Oh, man. Dude. Here's my spear. I'm going to pick a couple of these while these guys are running around with their head cut off. These are always great for a little snack in a forest. You can also sell them off if you guys find them. Berries are definitely a lot faster to grab. Oh, took it like a champ, dude. You took it like a champ. All right. Boom. Boom. Yes. Oh, knife required. What the frig? I didn't bring a knife? Are you kidding me? Did my knife break or did I leave it behind? Oh, for freak's sake. Okay, I'm going to need two rocks and five sticks. All right, we have a stick, so just need two freaking rocks. Anybody know where the... Oh, bugger off, dudes. Don't you dare come and hit me because I hit your friend. All right, uh, rock number one. And there's rock number two. Beautiful. Craft and fly, baby. I wonder if that other knife... I mean, it might have broken. I didn't realize if it did. Okay. So let's get in there. Let's grab that baby up. Again, we could probably sell off most of the stuff we're getting right now. I'm happy I got that buck, though. I feel bad I'm killing all the girl dearest. Alright, she's buggering off. She, she saw what happened. Right in the neck. Holy moly. Gotta hope those little bums are not coming after me. Okay. There's a. That was at a face, dude. Double face shot. Oh, oh, that sucks for you. Yeah, letting those women go out there and get killed. You got antlers, dude. You should come after me. All right. Um, all right. Let's do this. Let's see. Where's my other wooden spear? The one that didn't break. Okay. The other one broke for sure. And there's still some more mushrooms here and a fly. Oop. Grab it. Whoop. All right. How much weight do we have on this? 28. I think we can grab ourselves one more deer if possible. It wouldn't be such a bad thing for us to have. Again, we're going to move up for hunting. Just about there. Oh, for frick's sake. Oh, dude. 
Come on. Let's get him. Grab him. We need to move up our skills. Save time. More food. I'm about to cook it all up and uh and that'll be actually quite amazing. Alright, let's see where the other one went. There it is. Right through the freaking tree. How many spears do I have left? I have quite a bit. We're in pretty good shape. It's just weight I have to worry about now. 28. Okay. There we go. Pick up the mushrooms too. Like I said, always good to have. They're worth like, I think, two bucks. They sell for like one. Uh, but they're also great for tummies. <laughs> We're hungry. <laughs> so I'll take it. That's right. I said tummies. <laughs> it's good for my tummy tum tum. Yeah, it looks like a miserable day today too. A little bit of rain going on here. All right. All right. I think I've taken up most of the population over here. Such a good idea to take all the females. I'm not sure if that affects it in any way, shape, or form. I get worried that we're going to have that problem. Well, I don't see anything else we can utilize or kill around here. Back there, I don't want to take out too many of them. Uh, maybe one more buck would be nice, but uh, I don't think he's out and about here anymore. Uh, there is some good stuff here, though. Like I said, we'll grab it on our way back. Grab, grab, grab as much as we possibly can. Always helpful. Love it. We love to have the same thing for the rocks and stuff. All right, we're in pretty good shape. All right, so let's go bring back the meat. We'll cook it up. Let's cook up a storm and uh, get ourselves ready. Oh, oh, more mushrooms. More mushrooms. I'm not going to bother. I'll probably end up selling them. Our food, too. I think we're going to end up selling that, too. And trying to make a little bit of money. I'd love to bring up this guy with me. Uh, but again, like I said, I probably will have to bring him out there and uh, doing some trapping. Uh, maybe, or some hunting out there. Maybe it's because he doesn't have a weapon. I don't know. I, do I have to bring that weapon to him? That's the question. I guess you guys will come out to the comp fields and help me out with that for sure. Oh, thank you. Oh, I really need to get those bird feathers. How much we get for each one? Seven. And one meat. Okay. That's pretty good. This is traps broken almost. Yes, it's done. Okay. Make yourself another one of these. We'll grab some more wood here. Thankfully enough, it seems to be really handy right beside us. Love it. Grab that. And we're going to cook this baby up and make our trap again. Which they work well together. I don't know if they're hanging out or not. I figure one would see the other one dead and going, Jesus, what happened to Bob again? All right. <laughs> All right. Open this up. Trapeze and boom. Okay. Love to see that actually happen. We walk up to it and see it. Be pretty cool. All right. Let's get into our house here. We're going to get a little bit of warmth. And let's see if we can't cook up all this fine stuff. 25 pieces of meat. We have to prepare ourselves to uh, next month. Actually, you know what? I can make myself stews and stuff with this stuff. Probably should leave the meat in there. And I think we're going to be able to harvest up some stuff. And we have cabbage and stuff, I think, coming next month, right? So what do we need for that? We do have salt and stuff. I don't know how you do that. Salt and meat. I don't know if you guys know how to do that. But I uh, would love to learn how to do it. We do have some salt, by the way. Carrots, salted. All right, carrots, meats, cabbage. So cabbage and salted meat. Cabbage and meat. There we go. So that's not enough resources. We do have cabbage coming in. They're planted. So we have 23 meat. And uh, yeah, so we'll be able to make at least the cabbage ones and the pots. Yeah, so we'll, let's try that out. We'll leave the meat behind. I was going to cook it all up, but at this point, you know, in case, you never know. All right, we'll drop that off. We'll eat up our two pieces of meat that we have right here. And how are we doing on food? Probably a little bit more. We have that flatbread too. Everything's still in great condition. I don't know why. Is it because we're 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 holding it better? Or it's because maybe the guys are keeping it on themselves in the other house? Man, you really need lights in here, dude. Okay. The salespeople I'm talking about, not the house, but the salespeople themselves. I wonder if they that's an issue. Because even here, the meat's doing well. I mean, even the stuff here. Where's my soup's gone? Are they eating it all? Oh, we have a lot here. So we're going to grab ourselves a couple. Make sure we can eat. I guess I'm going to have to hunt a little more with these people. They may be eating up all the stuff that we're putting together here. Okay, so the only thing left for us to do is pretty much uh, build a barn. And I'm going to have I can only keep eight different buildings. And that I means the sewing place is going to have to go and disappear, unfortunately. Yeah, I know. I, I'm like, God darn it. 
<laughs> but it's okay. We'll get rid of it for now. I'm not using it currently anyways. Uh, we need to build that barn. Let's turn on this so we can see what we're doing. And the slackers are standing there. I was thinking about building a place for them in the forest, like I mentioned, and I don't know if we're going to do that. I'll wait for you guys in the comment fields and tell me what is what. I'm curious to see. Now we're full on this one, right? Is that good? Because that's bad, I guess, right? He's not going to be able to put anything inside of this. Okay, we'll grab the sticks. Oh, man, dude, I'm so heavy. What am I going to do? I'm going to drop some on the ground. Okay? That's what we're going to do. We're going to drop some here. If I need them, I'll grab them. And I don't need to carry these with me because it's just ridiculous amounts. All right. Don't. Do not lose that stick. You keep your eye on that stick. Do you understand? All right. You keep it up, dude. <laughs> All right. So thank you all for being here. Do appreciate it. We'll uh, probably take this down uh, for next episode and uh, start looking at building that barn as fast as we possibly can and hopefully some feathers and stuff so we can get rolling. It'll be nice. So thank you all for being here again. You guys are the best. Disc Game Edge. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Mm -hmm.